All right, we're about to tell you about some great summer camps where your kids can learn stuff they can't learn anywhere else. We're talking about wilderness skills, all kinds of things. Uh, joining us to talk more about that is uh, Verna Gates with Camp uh, with uh, uh, Fresh Air, and also uh, the camp director, Lieutenant Joe Green, joins us to explain a little. The Fresh Air family and a sheriff's department of Jefferson County present this camp. It's your fifth year, is that right? Our fifth year, yes. We've enjoyed our partnership with Sheriff Hale. It's great. Well, I love some of the things kids can learn in these because I, I mean, I, I feel I, I, I'm gonna I'm missing out on this because these are these are fourth through sixth grade, right? Yep. Oh, yeah. Come join so us. So <laughs> there's some things I need to learn here. But the, <laughs> Lieutenant, talk about some of these things you're gonna be teaching the kids. Well, they're gonna learn how to build shelters. They're gonna learn how to use and make maps. How to do land navigation. Um, how to purify water. Basic survival skills. Wow. But these things they translate to life skills as well. Mm -hmm. You know, when we talk about building fires, we talk about fire safety. When we talk about um, you know these different skills it gives us opportunities to go over basic things that kids deal deal with on a day-to-day -day basis mm -hmm. like uh, bullying for example right right so things that they'll take back home and back to school well after. stuff like here I mean you're gonna help them identify between venomous and non-venomous snakes oh yeah I mean you never know when you might need that skill. <laughs> seriously in Alabama yeah uh, you absolutely. a lot these days a lot more than you think absolutely <laughs> now how much would you guys be using new technology in, in any of this because that's what you know all these kids seem to have these days None. <laughs> yeah well we <laughs> leave, leave the phones and the iPads at home is that right yeah oh yeah but you know the skills that they learn they apply to their online behavior and mm -hmm. and you know like I said day to day at school right so um, you know I hope that helps them well, the I most think sophisticated so. tool is a compass <laughs> right exactly when that, oh, they sure. have those on the phones we should say that but I love yeah. this too they, they learn how to find uh, edible and medicinal plant, uh, plants you never oh, know yeah. you might need those right you never know oh, yeah. for products, uh, yeah. I just love this stuff now, now it's kids uh, fourth through sixth fourth grade fourth through sixth grade yes. all right now tell them when the camps are ha coming up well we've got four camps we have Red Mountain Park which is June 13th to the 17th mm -hmm. we've got Ruffner Mountain which is 27th through the f July 1st okay. and we have Trustful and we have one July 11th through the 15th and Tana Hill Historical Park, July 18th to the 22nd. And we have a lot of scholarships. The sheriff provides a lot of opportunity for kids to be able to come to this camp. And we want to invite everybody to come who has children that are interested. And we'll also, you mentioned, forgot to mention, we will be tracking the legendary beast, Bigfoot, really? too, in our, oh, yes. Okay, all right, that'll make it interesting. And, and there's a lot of fun stuff for them to do. I mean, the learning stuff is great, but the, you, do, you guys do provide a lot of time for them to, to have some fun as well. But um, the other thing about this I like is that it's, it's all day. And I imagine they're, it's filled up with activities, right? Oh, yeah. oh yes. Oh, yeah. oh, yes. It's amazing how many things you can do with learning first aid and getting out. And foraging takes time, you know, getting yeah. out there. And the kids love to get in the creek beds. Mm -hmm. You know, we think kids have gotten more sophisticated. I'm here to tell you they have not. You throw them in a creek bed looking for crawdads, and they are happy as a clam. You have to pull them out and say, we got to go do something else now. Oh, yeah. And, Lieutenant, I bet you would love to get those kids that probably stay cooped up in the house all summer. Oh, yeah. You'd probably love to get those mm -hmm. kind and just open up a whole new world for them. Right? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And there's so many things to show them out there at these places like Red Mountain at Ruffner Mountain, beautiful places, historic places, um, mm -hmm. and I can't wait to show them. All right, well, he's going to teach me how to do a lot of this stuff before you know, he leaves. One thing, too, we were amazed at the confidence they get just after a week Absolutely. of learning these skills. Learning these skills, that's what it empowers you, it does. Mm -hmm. All right, thank you so much. So for more information, freshairfamily.org, uh, that's how you can get information to register, and we'll provide a link, too, on the WBRC News app. All right, still ahead.